Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Yeah, I should really fix that. I just cut it. I'm not going anywhere, so it doesn't really matter, does it? No. What's our weather forecast here for the next week? Atmospheric river. Yeah, we're supposed to get a ton of rain. Yeah. Yeah, what's the, uh, what's the weather like in Cabo San Lucas right now, Kim? I think it's a low of 19 at night. Yeah, that says it all. Kim's going to Cabo San Lucas and me and Max are staying here. Sorry, guys. So we'll see how this filming goes. <laughs> she leaves tomorrow morning. And, uh, well, I just continue on with work. <laughs> super nice guy. Gotta yeah, say. super nice guy. Best husband in the world. Oh, I thought you meant him. No, Max. You. Yeah. Well, it's good that you can get away, that's for sure. Yeah. See what the girls think after. So you have to show me how to put the pills in Max's medicine? Mm, yeah, no. that didn't put work the, out so well. I'm going put the, on medicine just before I leave. Put the medicine in the pills. No, put no. the medicine in the chicken in his put meal. Put the pills in the chicken. It's not looking and good, And shake but it on up. It's not looking good, Put but. the pills in the chicken and you check it all about. I don't know. <laughs> I don't you know. two are going to have to figure it out. We'll figure it out. For, ready for Maxi 101? Why? What's going on? He's ready. Mm. Better give you a good example. Not quite full. Okay? Yep. Come over here. You watching, bud? Because you got to do this while we're gone. I keep this little thing here to cut his pills on. I just kind of go in a row here for these. So every meal he gets one of these. And he gets one of these big guys. And then he gets two of these little red ones. Hope you're paying attention, sir. One big one, two little ones? Yeah. That's it. Yeah, these big ones are really big. They're massive, but they got little lines on them, so I just cut them into four. Oh. Good bakery scraper. They look delicious, buddy. And then I just make little pockets in the chicken. Give it a little squish. The chicken. Yeah, and he's got two more. One here, one here, and your pulled pork's in there too. It's hard to get it in sometimes. And this is twice a day. Breakfast and dinner. He watches me put the pills in, but he doesn't spit them out. <laughs> so he's pretty good about that. You good about that, bud, bud? He just doesn't understand why it takes so much longer now to get his dinner. Who's a good boy? Who's a good guy? Same as the red ones, I just pop them in too. one you with me yeah well i know how to feed them mm -hmm. i just needed to know about the medications okay. <clears throat> do like 10 this way well, i prefer to do like six well he likes it fine huh. then i kind of just chop that up a bit and then i throw like three little decoy chickens on the top And he's none the wiser. Even though he watches you cut it. He's a good guy. Yeah. He's a good, good pill eater. He picks all the pills first. Is that the end of the story? Yep, that's the end. You got after he finishes eating, you have to do a, a perimeter check to make sure he didn't spit any out.
Keep right. day. Are you taking that can with you? Yeah. All right. All see right. you later. That's it. Best husband ever. Love you too. Have a good trip. This airport is so busy. People just cutting people off left and right. It's like boom, boom. I gotta say, Mark's gotta be the most unselfish person I know. He's staying home, doing all the important stuff, and letting you take off for Cabo for a week. See how this adventure goes. Just like mud. We didn't get it washed. In hindsight, maybe we should have. It looks like we have a gray car, not a black car. All right, here we go. <sighs> Stressful drive for Kim. Hi. Oh, it's a little sweaty. First stop, I'm just getting some air in the tires. Felt a little wobbly. Gentleman's gonna help me. He's gonna help me so I can see through my windows because it's not working really well. But it's a beautiful day. Navigate this. 
And I think we can finally get to the house. And then maybe relax a little. After I put the groceries away. Mark's favorite place. Loves him some Home Depot in Cabo. Seems to spend a lot of time there. Looks like a big improvement in the road since the last time we were here. There's a little bit of bulldozing and digging. You can see the cement again. So definitely moving in the right direction. Massive improvement since the last time we were here. That was only a couple months ago, so gotta like it. Ooh, bump. Why do people have to tailgate? I don't know. Go around. Yeah, this is so much better. It's still bumpy, but pretty damn good. Wow, am I ever a lucky person, I gotta say. Minerva and probably Erica have this place just beautiful. Everything is so clean. And she even left me some flowers. They're gorgeous. Thank you, Minerva. They're beautiful. And Mark, turn the air conditioning on before I got here so the house is nice and cool because I'm a little sweaty and how he was at the pool he turned the hot water tank on for me and the gas and it looks like we're gonna have a stellar sunset awesome day on the bread let's do these little tiny twist ties drives me nuts but I'm smarter than that I brought a stash from the bakery fix that problem ah. well good morning everybody it's three in the morning uh, I had a horrible night's sleep Max was up barking at the bears all night so I probably got about two hours sleep and a long day ahead of me. You know what? Kim's in Mexico, sound asleep in the nice warm tropical weather. Anyway, I'll check in with you periodically today.
I just pulled over here this morning to take a little break. Look at this guy. Back on my rooftop. It's a little hazy. It's a little cloudy. But the sun is peeking out. I'm good with that. It's not rain. It's not cold. Gotta like it. Those palm trees are getting huge. Can't really see the arch anymore. Let's see if we go down low, maybe. I don't know. Well, the mandarin tree is doing stellar. Some of the neighbors have picked some off. There's like 15 on there. When I got here last night, I couldn't really see that well. But yeah, they're big for mandarins. And I guess we lost one kind of squishy. Yeah, I'm going to definitely pick a couple of those and try them while I'm here. Everything else in the garden seems to be doing very well. Cactus, I guess I just missed it blooming because all the buds are left. And the hibiscus is just blooming like crazy right now. My chore today, wash the truck. Probably doesn't show up that good, but she's a very dirty.
Okay. Let's pick one. Hmm. I don't know. It's on there pretty good. Maybe they're not ready. I'll try this one. Yeah, I don't know. No, they're on there really good. I don't want to pick them too soon, but I would like to try one. Oh, just fell off. All right, let's give it a little wash and see what happens. Okay. That's really sweet. Hmm. Oh, there's seeds. Hmm. Could start another tree. Hmm. Diet for crab. Perfect. Good pick on the tree, Mark. Buenas noches from Mexico. Well, that was the first couple of days of my trip, and I'm sure Mark's having a lot of fun. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see what I can get up to next. Maybe we'll go out and have some fun on the beach. And I'm sure Mark and Max have some fun up their, up their uh, sleeve for us to view. Catch you on the next one. Adios.